here, Nate, on the left. Yeah, looks like there's a name in my phone again. Yeah. Ready? Yep, go. You hear people fighting. Oh, somebody's fighting, not us. Yeah. Now you said my sound's working today, it's not weird. <laughs> yeah. Kill them? Yeah, why not? You get the left as well. Yeah, there's a lot to do around here. It's crazy the way she jumps in when she's using a pistol. Yeah, I don't understand that at all. There. Okay. Yeah. Around the back? Yeah, it must be. Or is it up on top? Uh, it could be up on top. I vaguely remember it being on top. Yeah. straight in front of us as well there. You oh, the, want, yeah. You go to the pedestal. That. Yeah. Pedestal, yeah. updating. Objective updating. Remember there being a named up here as well. 
Oh, pops the right. Slicing of the fourteen. Come on, Kelly, you fight. Why aren't you fighting? <laughs> Looks like that's all they're now back to the building. Endurance of willpower, that's uh, what's it like, innit? Yeah, it's sorceress. Assembly. Yeah, I got the same one. Nice. <laughs> they quit hitting my caps lock instead of my, uh, my, <laughs> my movement keys. I can see him there. That's a death jump. Yeah. Yeah, that's the girl just to the right. Yeah, and yours is to the left, is it? Yeah. I'll go left first then. No, oh, that's mine green. This group one, this. Group phase. Oh, that's a group phase. Yeah. Yep. I don't know the story about a guy who's still the sick rock. Still turns black, it's easy to knock. But if you want to grab a gun, I'll grab that one. Both of us got to do it. 
Nice, I forgot about that. Oh, that's that helmet we came in here for. Yeah, Musk of Revan. Mm, yeah, you're right, looking around, it's not like simple, it can't be. Put it on. Rather easy. Was a bit. And that for group phase, it'd be a little bit tougher. So which one was that? Uh, that was the Mask of Revan, yeah, re return to Ladra or Torren. Okay. We have to decide which one to go to, I think. Yeah, I think one is light side and one is dark side. Yeah, I think the woman will be the dark side option. And yours is straight across. That's red. Oh, hang on, that's why. Access. You, you thought you could take me by surprise, but you can't. What do you want to bet this ends badly? Those were my daughter's <laughs> access codes you used. Whatever you've done to her, I'll have my revenge. Calm down, Theodore. Your daughter is fine. Fine? Imperial intelligence doesn't leave people fine. You people took away my wife, stole her from my house one night, and never told me what happened. My only daughter grew up to be worthless, and now you've taken her from me too. I despise your kind. Ooh, well, I only, only got a light side option. Hmm. Get you get some light side points. We can resolve this peacefully if you'll just listen to me. Got minus one on the now, pet for that. There won't be any peace until the Empire changes its <laughs> ways. Light side points for nothing. Oh, I see. This is Watcher Two. I'm downloading the contents of Theobor's computers. Looks like blueprints, work he's done for Lord Grethen, and, ah, encrypted files. I should be able to decipher them if I cross-reference with the slave's datapad. Hmm. 
don't like what I'm seeing. There's a timetable, activity convergences, indications of something big. Get back to base as soon as you can. I'll head there immediately. I'll see you soon, Agent. Watch your two out. Okay. That would appear to be it. Alright, so I gotta go all the way around tomorrow. Right. Lead the way. upstairs Level 14. Grass. Oh, what have we here? You're not even a Mandalorian, are you? When Lord Grathen's spy said my father contacted the Mandalorian Enclave, I expected they'd at least send me a real live Mandalorian. I'm afraid I'm a tad disappointed. Now she has a problem. You knew your father wanted English you killed. Accent. Of course. But really, how scary is that? <laughs> Wait, you don't seriously think you can kill me? I mean, I'm a Sith, and you're just... Uh, whatever you are. <laughs> oh, we've got a true believer. Then again, it makes sense. Why would you come here if you thought you'd die? Apparently, my father isn't the only one living in a dream world. You can't kill a Sith, you silly. Why would your father hire me if you can't be killed? To save face, naturally. Don't you understand how any of this works? A more powerful Sith could kill me. Or a really lucky Jedi, I suppose. Perhaps a bomb, but not some random bounty hunter. You must be so crushed. Live and learn, <laughs> I guess. Except, not in your case. Sorry. It is tough. What? I, I lost? I can't lose. What you lost? I'm Sith. You were Sith. Now you're just done. Can't die like this, falling to some common bounty hunter. Everything Lord Grothen told me was a lie. I've been living in a dream world. It can't end like this. It can't. I sense a dark side killing coming on. Yeah. I feel for you, girl. Close your eyes now. I just can't believe it. Fifty dark side and twelve pet points. <laughs> That's a win. That is a win. <laughs> okay, so I'm done in here.
There's something over here. Yeah, there's know. something green here. The group phase. Yeah. Oh, I remember this. Oh, I remember this. Yeah, there's yeah. some of these these things, right? You have time you run through. Yeah. Apart from this one, where you can't, you have to go through it. Drum and cars clashing with Lord Grath. Huh? Oh, it's a blue one. That is a blaster rifle, so that is you. Uh, I think it's my pet, not mine. Rifle? Yeah. That's you. I'm a sniper rifle. I use a sniper rifle. Oh, that's a blaster rifle. I use blaster pistol. I can use it. Oh, what the hell. I'll give it a try. See what happens. Simply terrible. Somebody has to stop me. Somebody has to stop me right now. Are you the one who's controlling these turrets? I'm ashamed to say yes, but not by choice, I assure you. I'm programmed to understand over 100 languages and dialects, and in not one is the phrase on fire positive when referring to a person. <laughs> Why, of all droids, I was chosen to maintain these awful things and protect their schematics, I will never understand. Oh, if only I didn't have this terrible restraining bolt restricting my actions. I'd destroy the plans to those turrets in an instant. Why not shut down the turrets themselves? Lord Grathen would have me for scrap if I did that. The turret schematics are stored within my databanks. If the restraining bolt was removed, I could delete them ensuring that no more turrets could be built. It's the next best thing to disabling the turrets themselves. If you value organic life, you will remove my restraining bolt and let me destroy the schematics once and for all. I'm downloading the plans for the Imperials. If you're insistent on it, there's nothing I can do. After all, I'm not programmed for combat. If it were up to me, Organic species would not be allowed to do such horrible things to each other. I don't like it either, but I have a job to do. Well, I still don't understand it. And furthermore, it's a good thing I don't have a stomach. Because watching Lord Grathen's test subjects burst into flames would be more than I could handle, I think. Well, it looks like we're done in here as well. Okay. Oh, I am on fire. <laughs> Is it, right? Well, there doesn't appear to be anything else in here, so must be on, on the way out. Yeah, come on, run, 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 uh, uh. Ah. <laughs> uh, that was bound to happen. <laughs> I've no idea what points I'm spending in this skill tree, you know. Oh, yeah. 
I'm just randomly putting in the things that look like they're good. Around their side. Hmm. Oh, oh, I'm sorry. Is it you that? This slicer. Oh, right, slicer. Yeah. You don't have slicing, do you? No, I don't know. I'm stealing them all. <laughs> Of course, the, the loot is in the mob farthest away from me at all times. <laughs> so it's that one straight ahead? Yep, looks like it. Now we got more. That was ugly. <laughs> What's your life, Nate? Yeah, she's healing me. I've already used. I used a potion and the, or whatever, a med pack and. You know, I go the right spot. Okay. Is there you? Stop! You must not steal that precious data, I implore you. When I'm not locked in Grathen's science dormitory, I face you in person. I can only hope the passion of my plea convinces you. I'm Lana Tadrog, lead researcher of Lord Grathen's cybernetics division. That data you're stealing is my life's work. You're another of Grathen's prisoners, right? How is this your life's work? <laughs> I'm no prisoner. I volunteer for this project because Grathen alone had the resources to help me achieve my goal. I'm the creator of Project Arc, Automatic Regenerating Cybernetics. I've developed mechanical body parts that grow and heal like actual flesh and bone. Making better soldiers is an obvious application, but my dream is to give these lifelike replacement limbs to the victims of war. Idealism will only get you killed. The galaxy brings many opportunities to make a credit, but so few to make a difference. I have to try. Lord Grathen encrypted my research notes to prevent duplication, but that data spike will download everything and erase the original. You're taking the only copy. Please don't steal that data. Allow me to continue healing the sick. I 
was promised a lot of credits for this, and I plan to collect. I hope you can live with the knowledge you failed to make the galaxy a better place. Enjoy your filthy credits, thief. Credits always make my galaxy a better place. <laughs> I'm surrounded by scoundrels and profiteers. I pity you, really. Is he Scottish? Day. Yes. He is. Look at that. I'm learning. <laughs> yeah, I'm learning dialects. I'd help you. <laughs> no stopping you now, mate. Whoa. Oh, right into it. This ain't your party. Still got a lot to do around here. <laughs> well, most of that's outside, so we just need to go back do that turn in back over on the other side. Are you fighting me? Yeah, I didn't drop anything last time either. Since you're back there. 